don't open. As breeze they blow, na so far on yash they open. That very blog where it be said, na may matter, na that one carry. Now because of that very blog, na it make a way be said with a stand, tan, 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 like this for a beautiful queen may. If not, that blog therefore don't bring me down, not be smarting. Honestly speaking, you guys know say now for online here. Now we for the pick our gist where they break come. And we know they go get them from me at all. No, 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 no. Because men are very private person. We know they reveal anything where they happen. So they don't begin to spread lies. They go on on the media say, you a doche na in the duamo, don't go to celebrate the happy say. You don't win matters say, as in eh, the way where you a doche and do the Aussie country come and they celebrate. May a doche lega team come say, ah, it surprised them all. Oh. So see, say Juju Austin and Yul Edoche. Then begin the celebrate. Not be so much, you know, may Edoche legacy don't fall out. Say, eh, eh, eh. no way we go out to bring the gist to online in laws table. May they foresee waiting happen. That very blog self come they talk and say, Yul Edoche has never ever denied Judy Austin in court. Eh, well, look, now this one I can make a way be say, may Edoche legacy come say, all right, since you say you not deny Judy Austin for Court. Now you can't bring out all oh, you let don't you response. Make una sit down. Go to give una the gist more some more. Aproko to the sweet. Eh? There is nothing sweeter than Aproko. Eh, well, okay. I go to read down for una. Una go to see on the display for the front of the screen. No go be like saying a patient's blocks. Now they add Maggio or sugar. I no go add anyone. I go just drop on the way the man say add the aginomoto. I drop it for you guys. You go enjoy them. No be me talk amo. Obro mwa. It's not me. I am not there. I no fitting to day there. I cannot fit Fifteen to buy for small picking. Mm -mm. So my people, pardon my grammatical. May we enter the main gist? I can't fit into <laughs> my people. My people, the Lega team of me and Doche, they make my body. They do me. Tiririn, tiririn, tom, tom. Hey, if they make butterfly, they enter my belly. Hey, hey, hey. Because like this, eh, the man can't come out, can't zanzalize everything. He can't realize the matter. He can't disguise you, you are still you, let okay? For us all to see, maybe we all understand. I told you guys before, I said this week, they get court case. Yes, the very first one, where they do, they say, okay. The second one, they can't cancel around. I'm going to hear just now for the video. Don't be so much, you know. I'm going to see for the right talk from me. A Doche Lega team, not be me talking. All right, now make I start up with the readings of me a Doche Lega team. What he in talk about? He can say you le Doche and Judy align true. He can mention the woman name. They say that Jenny blog maybe her name. I don't want to mention and finish. So he can say you a Doche and Judy Austin align true the blog. Then he can say DPA Family Law Clinic. We don't know why you and Judy would be lying to the world using bloggers we saw this morning where the blog i'll call on the blog was saying that you and judy never denied in court that they were married <laughs> he can't say that's outrageous because we we are not going to discuss what is going on in court in this case because of the court admonish everybody not to discuss it, but when you and Judy are all hell bent on deceiving the world, it becomes imperative to correct them. Then he can say, You can read below the specific allegations in the petition and how you and Judy denied allegation, clearly stating that they were not married. And never attempted to marry. Yul is the respondent, whilst Judy is the co-respondent. Now let me read what the respondent. They say the petition. The petition. Let me read. They say the respondent left Lagos for Enugu in the following day, twenty-first of April, twenty twenty-two, a Thursday, and on Sunday. The 24th of April 2022, the petitioner found out again on social media, Gist Lover blog, that the respondent was performing traditional marriage rights with the party seated in her hometown in Anambra State, as when the information was posted. The petitioner shall rail on the said 
publication at the trial of the this suit, which is May is the petitioner. All right. So now, Yule's answer. Let me read Yule's answer. The respondent categorically denied paragraph ten of the petition and states that his uh, the said just lover a blog publicated was false and foiled by gist lovers enterprise in fake news and cows that since the news of the birth of the respondent son and uh, child which the, re the co respondents in june 2021 gist lover as a negative blog that derived in fake and manipulative information for financial gain had been negatively exploiting every movie or skills performed the respondents and correspondents and the generating social media traffic for financial benefit therefore the respondents hereby put the petitioner to the strictest proof therefore that may should bring the proof okay now this is the petition then the petitioner is a Christian and married the respondent as a Christian. She never imagined or planned to be in a polygamous marriage. So she refused being manipulated by the respondent into a polygamous marriage. The respondent also on different occasions had meeting with the petitioner and the children, which is May Edoche and the children are the petitioner, right? So he said, manipulating them into accepting a polygamous fi family by telling the children how God made Pharaoh stubborn and that the situation is not as bad as the petitioner may <laughs> made it to look. Okay. This is you, Ledoche's answer. Let's read you's answer. The respondent denied paragraph 10 uh, of the petition. And ever that the, the respondent has never tried or even planned to manipulate the petitioner or the children into having a polygamous marriage. While you they lie into having a polygamous family. <laughs> the respondent by exposure knows that there can be polygamous family legally when the respondent and a petition and the petitioner had their English marriage in court. That's the story of the Bible about Pharaoh. Was a different story which the respondent actually tells the children whenever the respondent is admonishing and teaching the children about the cause of stubbornness and pride respondent stated that he never told the, the pharaoh story in connection with polygamy which is unrelated that is Yul's answer now let's hear to the austin's answer how they denied then the court uh, respondent categorically denied paragraph 10 of the petition and stated that the said gist lover blog publication was false and foiled by gist lovers enterprise in fake news and chows i mean cows there was no traditional marriage ceremony between the respondent and the co-respondent on the 27th of june on the, i mean on the 27th of april 2022 or any other date whatsoever, the correspondent hereby put the petitioner to the strict proof, therefore, they, they ask him to bring proof. You see now, so this very woman that said that uh, the DPA lied, this was the reason why they needed to bring this thing out, to let you know that the, the uh, respondent and the correspondent, they denied themselves in court. Which is the truth, and you can see it in the front of the screen. Now let's get back to today. I mean, to the uh, court hearing. What happened? 
what happened and the reason why they, you Ledochi and Judy Austin are celebrating they, they, even the Lega team are still kind of surprised to see that they are celebrating because there is nothing to celebrate in this very matter now let's read the last court date in the Yul Edoche case. I told you guys, I said there is a 2K, 2, 2, 2 dates. Say the last day. Let's listen to what he said. The case of Yul Edoche was scheduled for Tuesday, March. It don't happen. Tuesday, March, on Monday, a day before. A day before the hearing. All the court received a message from the court. Informing them that the court would not sit the entire week again. They don't want to sit again, okay? Before the judge was out on conference. This happened from time to time. A judge might get involved in a conference or special mission which causes the court to postpone a hearing. The new date was assigned and the court was actually gracious to contact the parties in advance rather than allowing them to get to the court before finding out. We were surprised to see you and Judy celebrating inconsequential and fortuitous events as if it were something that they engineer. For us, we see their behavior as a sign of frustration and depression. A person who has a good case does not celebrate the fact that a hearing date was postponed. To the public, however, you may see it as a problem, but it is not a problem to us. We have nothing to worry about. We urge you to understand that the behavior of Yule and Judy can only be things did not go the way they had intended. Their prayer now is that the trial will get postponed. That, that is not the behavior of a person proud of where he found himself. So what was the celebration for Biko Kwano? <laughs> Ah, God, the reason why he dropped this thing is because of the blog who goes about lying, saying that uh, they've won mayor, don't you, in court, all those things, and it's a lie. The court postponed later, as in for this week, they postponed everything at the end of the day. They first, the first court hearing had, uh, had taken place, but later they did not continue. You see, uh, they don't continue the court case, so they postponed it. So now tell me, where... What are they celebrating for? What is Yule celebrating for? What are they celebrating? <laughs> the fact is, what Yule, Edoche, and Judy Austin want is that Queen May's fans needed to back out. They want you guys to feel like things is not going well for me. So many of you now will not feel like, okay, they've won. Let us just forget about me. Please don't let that happen. You can hear now the legal team, which is a maker, Esquire, Uguanyi Esquire, the legal team of May, Edoche, has just released... Everything for you guys to see. How you, Edoche and Judy Austin, denying themselves, number one. And how that woman lied that they did not deny themselves. He is proving it to all of us. And now that he knows that Judy Austin and you, they are pulling out lies on the media space. And he needed to speak. Because you cannot just keep quiet or because of, ah, no, let me not speak. No, you have to speak. You understand? Even though May did not, May, May don't need to speak. The legal team can do it for her. She doesn't need to say anything. So, guys, I will drop it here. Like and share. Patience Blogs TV. Catch you guys in my next one. <laughs> they all they celebrate for ordinary ground. Now, bye bye, yo.